Thank you and welcome back to the Las Vegas Sports Talk. Well, it's fight night tonight against Earl Spence Jr. and Terrence Crawford. Um, if you didn't check out my video on my prediction for the fight, go ahead and check it out um, before the fight starts. Also, if you need to get your banks from banks a lot, uh, make sure you uh, go get your bank. So when you finish watching my video, place your bet, you're able to put your winnings into your personalized banks from banks a lot. Uh, with that being said, I want to talk about yesterday's um, weigh-in for the Bud Crawford and Earl Spence. Um, I was there yesterday. Uh, it's pretty good. A little hot at the beginning, but I want to jump into what happened after or the back backstage okay unfortunately there was uh, two incidents that happened backstage that I want to talk about uh, Caleb Plant uh, smacked punched uh, Jamal Cello uh, in the face uh, take a look at this video right here <laughs> And as you can see, um, yeah, he got slapped. Uh, what happened? Uh, everything is fine. Was fine earlier that day, apparently, or maybe not. Um, as you can see, uh, Jamel Charlo was talking to Mike Tyson, laughing, uh, having a good time. But that was in the front earlier. But now, uh, when you get to the back, apparently um, there was an. Uh, they were talking or whatever, and he grabbed his beard. Uh, I don't know why you would grab the man's beard. Uh, so that's why he um, swung on him. And the only thing that was done was uh, someone threw a water bottle, as you can see. Mm. Right? Like, mm. Derek James, uh, you guys know him, he's the trainer. Um, he was watching it while doing a uh, video uh, or an interview with the XO Factor. And this is his reaction. Yeah. Good, good, good. So, wow, this, you know, that's crazy. And, you know, I asked him, you know, hey, was this, you think that was justified? And this is what he had to say. Man, is, can this be justified? You know, probably so. I think probably so, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I'm, not, I'm not saying I would, I, I wanted him to do that. I tried to de-escalate that. But I, I I didn't think he was gonna do it. But I kind of saw like he might. That's why I kept trying to talk to him. So there you go. Uh, but not only that, you also had uh, 
people are saying that his wife also got into an altercation uh, also. Um, the reports that it was the brothers wives that got into it uh, but as you can see from the pictures yeah not a good look not a good look uh, so I'm saying this to say I mean come on we gotta do better uh, boxing events um, now we're starting to see um, they're fighting in the crowd you know, spending all that money and fighting in the crowd uh, just for boxers to fight outside or behind the stage or behind the scenes. Uh, basically, it's not a good look. Uh, Terrence Crawford uh, said that when he was... Uh, speaking during the press conference, uh, during the weigh-in, or I should say after the weigh-in, you know, come on guys, we got to do better. So, this is my um, take on the situation, uh, got to do better, uh, hope this problem gets resolved, uh, make sure you guys hit that like button. Uh, definitely subscribe uh, to my channel. Um, you can find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And also, if you haven't checked out my prediction for the fight tonight, go ahead and check it out. Also, get you a personalized bank from Banks A Lot. Personalized banks for banks a lot. Uh, they're great for saving, uh, great for kids. Uh, you get to teach them how to save money. This is Marcus with the Las Vegas Sports Talk, and I'm out.